Hey guys, what's up? I figured I'd do a little multitasking. Uh, I want to start this prep off right by just sort of uh, being consistent with documenting. Um, you know, just everything that's been everything that's going to go on during this prep. Um, so today is Monday, I think February 13th. It's day one of my prep to the national show and. Uh, Hopefully right after the national show, I'll be doing a pro show. And then the goal would be to look so damn good that I qualify for the Olympia. Okay. Um, so yeah, just keep in mind, I am multitasking here. So I'm actually, don't do this at home, shifting with my left arm. But um, so I just wanted to uh, talk about day one of my prep. Basically what has been changed um, from, you know, yesterday to today is, you know, my calories have been really high for the past, oh, probably two months. I've been in a pretty good caloric surplus um, with, you know, the goal to build as much muscle mass as I can, which has actually gone, I think, pretty darn well um, just by the, the, my body weight and the way my clothes fit. It's not just, I don't think it's all fat, you know, um, my... I mean, obviously, fat is going to come with the muscle, but it's not like my jeans don't fit, which is great. So, however, my sports bras are barely fitting these days. Um, but uh, anyway, so I think the past two months, I've made some pretty good progress. Um, as of today, checked in with my coach, and um, he recommended that we just start off by uh, pulling some calories as opposed to adding cardio. I've been doing cardio maybe three days a week, cardio, conditioning, whatever you want to call it, workout, you know, it's, it's working out where you're breathing heavy. Um, so I'm going to maintain that, everything, you know, that's going to stay the same, training's going to stay the same, the only thing that changes is my calories. So I think I, I, I did a really quick skim of the numbers and I think it's about 500 calories um, less than what I have been eating on a daily basis. So. Um, it's kind of funny. It's not like uh, it's not like I'm hungry because I was in such a caloric surplus that it was sometimes hard to eat. Not all the time, but just sometimes. Um, but you know, there's something to be said for as soon as something um, as soon as something is taken away from you, you automatically crave it more. You know, it's so weird and it's so annoying. It's that whole the grass is greener on the other side you just can never get away from it. And it's, it's just so frustrating. Um, because it's like, as soon as I saw the email where, okay, we're going to cut your calories, which is exactly what I've been asking for. Like I've been so excited to start this prep all of a sudden I'm like, Oh shit. You know, um, I better like, you know, I don't know, just like already I'm, I'm like craving foods just because now I know that I can't have it. You know, it's so weird. Um, and I just gotta like understand that it's just one of those stupid emotions that like doesn't make any sense really because I know how bad I wanna prep and how, you know, I'm ready for this. Um, so I just sort of laugh at it, you know. Um, but so we're, you know, it's almost three o'clock. So I'm almost done with a full day. Um, been going strong. Um, so hopefully the goal is to start strong and finish strong. Um, and yeah, I. Ideally, I would like to keep at least a weekly blog um, going, just documenting, you know, my progress through the uh, through the prep. Um, that way, you guys can see the the high times and the oh so many low times. Um, but my show is 16 weeks out, so this is day one of however many days that is. Okay, cool guys. Um, thanks for checking in, and uh, we'll see you later.